Today, we've got a major update on the ongoing XRP lawsuit. Yeah, that one that's been dragging on forever between Ripple and the SEC. This time, both Ripple and the SEC are making some big moves, and it looks like we might be in for some appeals. So let's dive into what's happening and what this could mean for XRP holders and the broader crypto market. All right, let's get started with the latest development. Ripple and the SEC are reportedly seeking a stay on the monetary judgment in their lawsuit, which basically means that they're asking the court to pause enforcing any financial penalties while they gear up for potential appeals. Now, if you've been following the case, you'll know it's been a wild ride, with both sides scoring some wins and losses along the way. But this latest move suggests that the legal battle isn't over just yet. So, why are they seeking a stay? Well, it's pretty clear that neither side are fully satisfied with where things stand right now. Ripple's partial uh, victory earlier uh, on in 2023, which ruled that XRP sales were not securities when sold to retail investors, gave the XRP community a huge boost. But the SEC isn't backing down. They still want to appeal certain aspects of that ruling. At the same time, Ripple is also likely considering its own appeal on parts of the case, where the court ruled in favor of the SEC. Essentially, both sides are digging in for a longer fight, and this isn't just about Ripple and the SEC. This case has massive implications for the entire crypto industry, especially when it comes to how cryptocurrencies are classified and regulated in the United States. So, what's the vibe on social media? As usual, the XRP community, or the XRP army as they call themselves, is fired up. On X and Reddit, you'll see a lot of excitement mixed with frustration. Some XRP holders are hoping that this stay could mean that Ripple is in a strong position to negotiate or even settle the case. They're confident that Ripple's technology and global partnerships give it the upper hand, and they see this as a strategic move to buy more time for Ripple to solidify its position. On the other hand, there's also a bit of concern. Some are worried that these delays could keep XRP in legal limbo for a while longer, which would, could impact its price and adoption. After all, every time we think the case is moving forward or towards a conclusion, there seems to be another twist that drags it out even further. Overall, though, the sentiment in the XRP community seems cautiously optimistic. Many believe that Ripple has the upper hand in this case, especially after the partial victory in 2023. And they believe that partial appeals are just a bump in the road rather than a major setback. So if you're holding XRP, what does all this mean for you? Well, in the short term, we're probably going to see some volatility. News like this tends to shake things up in the market, and the possibility of more legal battles on the horizon could keep XRP's price swinging up and down for a while. But in the long term, this case is incredibly important for the future of XRP and even the broader crypto space. A win for Ripple could set a precedent that cl uh, classifies how cryptocurrencies are regulated in the United States, which would be a huge win for the industry as a whole. On the flip side, if the SEC manages to pull off a victory in the appeals process, it could spell trouble not just for Ripple, but the other crypto projects facing similar scrutiny. If you're an XRP holder, this this is definitely a time to stay informed, keep an eye on how the case develops, and of course, make sure you're comfortable with the risks involved. The crypto world can be incredibly unpredictable, especially when the legal issues are in play. The Ripple versus SEC lawsuit is heating up again, and it looks like we're in for some more twists and turns before things wrap up. What do you think? Is Ripple in a strong position to win this case, or are we in for more surprises? Drop your thoughts in the comments down below. We would love to hear what you think. If you've enjoyed this video, don't forget to smash that like button. And if you're new to the channel, make sure to subscribe and ring that bell so you don't miss another update. You can click here to watch our latest video. This is not one that you're going to want to miss.